She had woken me up. She had come and gone, and now I was being shot at. I had to catch her, find out what was going on. Hey, you! Mona! No one's driving me out of my home. Careful with that gun, lady. The detective from 304? I have... My lady? My lord, I came to see you, but now that I am here, I can see that this was a dreadful mistake. Kaufman wants us taken care of. Let's just find a guy so we can all- ah! Ah! I heard a noise. A noise woke me up. I had found the sniper's hideout. The room was full of surveillance equipment. Wait, am I retarded? I'm streaming a black screen like a retard. Why is it not capturing? What? Oh, I am really retarded. Because this is the scene that captures Max Payne. Okay, well, uh, we got from like... We got from like down there to up here, okay? Not a big deal. The building trembled as in a seizure. The sound of an explosion came from the direction of my apartment. I wasn't going to get through without the code. Behind the door were the suites. They weren't an improvement on the regular apartments. They're crazy. Hell, they want to clean. Oh my god. She woken me up. She had come and gone, and now I was being shot at. You! I had to catch her, find out what was going on. Mona. Once is taken care of. Let's just find a guy so we can.
Hello? I heard a noise. A noise woke me up. I found the sniper's hideout. The room was full of surveillance equipment. They had been spying on me for days, weeks, months even. My every action observed, recorded, analyzed. The place was the proof every paranoiac dreams of. The building trembled as in a seizure. The sound of an explosion came from the direction oh my of my God. apartment. Oh my I wasn't going to get through without the code. Behind the door were the suites. They weren't an improvement on the regular apartments. They're crazy. Hell, they want to clean out. Thanks, fella. You saved me. They barred the door from the outside. It's a terrible time. The tyranny of cleaners. Right. Any other way out? Up the roof, maybe. With the pigeon. You need the code to the seventh floor. Ed knows. You know Ed, the janitor. PD. I need the code at the seventh floor door. Sure, sure. I know it. I know it. Wait. Oh, yeah. 667. The <laughs> neighbor of the beast. Get it? Yeah. I get it. Okay. You stay here. Okay. In our headlights. It's not the same thing. Return to Sender Marathon. Two days and two nights of the 90s cult series. Address The explosion in my apartment had started a fire. The flames couldn't burn away my past. They only made the shadows behind me leap higher. I had to get down to the street. Shoot it! 
Mona had come through here, the dead cleaner's a sign of her passage. Open the door! Stop! <coughs> oh, oh, bless you. I, I owe you one. This is where the fun starts. No sweat. Used to be on a job. I was a cop like you. All right. Follow my the gas from the broken pipe was feeding the flames. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't get through. I was a cop. <laughs> Cost me my marriage. Long hours. He was terrified something would happen. I remember I got lost here last time too. She up and left me. Ah, sure. Started hitting Goddamn the bottle. Slime bags <laughs> open up. Anyone there would trapped have. in here. Uh. Oh, the sons of bitches have locked the door. You coming to my rescue? Gas valve was in the utility room. With the gas turned off, the fire on the third floor was no longer a problem. Jesus Christ. Sign of her passage. Open the door! <coughs> oh, oh, bless you. This is where the fun starts. Yeah, Goddamn no slime sweat. bags open up! There are people in here. On a job? <laughs> I don't know I'm just like you. All right, Go follow away. my lead. Yeah, <laughs> I was a cop. <laughs> Cost me my marriage. Long hours. He was terrified something would happen to me. I busted my hump. She up and left me. Ah, sure. Started hitting the bottle. <laughs> oh, the sons of bitches have locked the door. Are you coming to my rescue? Something like that. The oh, I got it. Utility room. You have to kind of trigger them. With the gas turned off, the fire on the third floor was no longer a problem. Oh, man. <laughs> Juice head. 
You gotta get me out of this. Your place or mine, huh? <laughs> hey, I was talking to Handsome here. Pain! I feel a lot better now that you're here. The feeling's mutual, baby. What's your problem, jerk? Oh. Wait, where's my... Oh, there it is. I was gonna say, where is this gun? The gun's actually really good. Oh my god, I almost just walked off the edge again. I'm saving. No shooting through corners, huh? <laughs> I, I knew it happened. I fucking knew it. I grant that this is the player, so it doesn't really prove anything. It could, you know, we could play by different rules, you know, you know how the game is programmed. But um, full of guns and a head full of video games turns the house into a shooting gallery. Breaks my heart. What the hell's going on? With me, he meant. I had my doubts about the cleaners spying on me. About Mona. According to Vladimir Lem, the mob captain Vincent Cogniti is behind the hits. Seems he's made a deal with an unknown third party. Maybe the cleaners. I don't know. Something doesn't fit. If it's true, I've been added on Gogniti's list. I came close to lying to Bravura. I told myself I needed to find out the facts first before others could screw up the evidence. But that was an excuse. Mona had gotten under my skin. I couldn't close my eyes to anything anymore. It was more important than the job. She had tried to reach me, left her number. Risky leaving your number at the police station. Trace the call and you'll see I'm talking to you from home. Winterson. I'll give you my address. Make sure you're not followed. Max, what's going on? What do you mean? Don't do anything stupid. Mona's place was a closed-down funhouse based on a 90s TV show. The show's cancellation had been the kiss of death to it. What? what? Oh, yeah, to, to the place. Okay. <laughs> I thought we were talking about the show. Yeah, of course. Getting cancelled is kind of the end, yeah? For a show. I felt like I was walking into a trap. I felt guilty. Like I was about to get caught.
There had been no lock on the front door. I had wondered why the place wasn't packed with hobos and stray dogs. Little wonder. Your past has a way of sneaking up on you. You'll hear broken echoes of it everywhere, like a bad replay. You get mad at everybody for reminding you about it, even if it's all in your head. When entertainment turns to a surreal reflection of your life, you're a lucky man if you can laugh at the joke. Luck and I weren't on speaking terms, or maybe the place was just too lame to be funny. Oh my fucking god. A fun house is a linear sequence of scares. Take it or leave it is the only choice given. Makes you think about free will. Have our choices been made for us because of who we are? I was behind the backdrops, getting warm. When I had first met Mona, her twin sister had been killed. It must have felt like madness, schizophrenia in reverse. Your other self suddenly falling silent. We had both lost our loved ones. Now I'll tell you one thing, Mona, you're no singer. You've switched tactics. We need to talk. Bring me a towel, will you? Now that you're here, you can watch my back while I get dressed. All she had told me was that someone wanted us dead. The way she was acting, I was the only one in danger here. You'll have to give me a lot more than that. The inner circle. What of it? The secret society is after everyone who knows of their existence. Come off it. Prove it. I have a contact inside. He's willing to talk. Alfred Woden? No. Anyways, I can take you to him. She wasn't telling me the whole truth. Let's go. The circle goes back to the centuries-old Masonic cults. Corruption and assassinations reaching all the way to the presidential level. Right. And here I was, thinking conspiracy theories had gone out of style. We're here. So are they. I'm the only one handling a piece here. Which floor? They're after him. The elevators work with the apartment keys and from the desk here. They've jammed most of them to the floors they're on. The guard set off the alarm before they were killed. We need to do this fast. Shouldn't we just wait for the cops? Here, so we can stay in touch. You operate the elevator from here and I'll go I'll up. I'll go up. You're the man. How come you're alive, anyway? I saw you take a bullet to the head. Maybe it's still there. Keeps me focused. 
for this to work. I was gonna have to trust her. Let's get to work. Cleaners ahead and to the left, guarding Corcoran's door at the opposite end of the hall. Walk across the room, Smoke. Taking a time like she was a supermodel on a catwalk until she's standing real. Is this the same gun? She goes, Your place of pay! Kill it! Jesus Christ, man. The door's locked. Try the door on the far right, next to the large painting. You can get to Corcoran's place through the balcony. Well, that's just it. Hey! They're cleaning other apartments as well. Corcoran said that other Inner Circle members live in the building. On the balcony. I'm in. Gotta look around. I'm going upstairs. Strip it down. Papers. Shoot the kill. Cover me. ready to go, not without a single piece of evidence. In the photo, a group of men posing in front of a manor house. Corcoran was there, Senator Gate was there, so was Alfred Woden. So it was true. All bets were off. The inner circle was involved.
don't know what next. More of them in the lobby ahead. No, no, no! What is this? Damn. Okay. Nice timing. What was that? Starting to sound like a broken record here. More cleaners to the right, in the lobby, behind the door. Thanks. You're done, boy. Get in here now! Get in here! Mayday, wake up! I'm out of ideas, Max. I'll check the apartment the cleaner was guarding. I risk my life on a window cleaner's lift when I can use the elevator. Max Mona, I found a window cleaner's lift. I'm headed down. Max? Yeah. Mona? Mona? Mona! Mona? Mona! Someone had got to Mona. Nothing had worked out as planned. I had to find another way down to the lobby. You can't hide! She come to me in the first place for help for something she wasn't telling me NYPD freeze easy dumbo 
Payne, what are you doing? What are you doing? The million dollar question I didn't have the answer to. What were you thinking? Were you thinking at all? I was following a lead. She was helping me. She is a fugitive murder suspect, for Christ's sakes! I was trying to save those people from the cleaners. The two cases are connected, mine and Winterson's. Senator Gate was killed by the cleaners. They are connected. Winterson can have them both. She doesn't back you up. I was doing my job. I'm sorry to do this, Payne, but it's for your own good. Hand me your guns. I'm putting you to a desk job. Start by writing a report on what the hell happened on the Upper East Side. Fraternizing with the enemy, I had stepped over the edge. The cartoon moment when the gravity waits for the coyote to realize his mistake before the plunge. Get yourself to a counselor. You're falling apart. When you're ready to go to AA, come talk to me. Get your act together. And get someone in here to help me with this mess. I was mad. At myself. At Prevora. At Mona. Was she worth this? Don't envy you. The way the boss goes on about I was putting off the inevitable. I had to go to my desk, get started on that damn report. We found you out of it on the... It was all connected. The murder of Senator Gate, the cleaners, the inner circle, Vinny Gogniti. I had to make Winterson see it. Winterson's phone was ringing. She wasn't at her desk. Winterson's phone. Oh shit, then. I mean, Winterson. She's been kind of edgy about her calls. I think she's in the interrogation room getting. We learned later Winterson was dirty, right? So this was this was you know, Vladimir. This was Vladimir Lem, you know, it's hanging up. I wanted to talk to Winterson when he realized it wasn't Winterson. They can't see you through the glass. Just take your time. See if you can recognize any of them. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Number two, step forward and speak the line you were given. <laughs> I can't read. Just say the line number one said. You think I was listening? You are nothing but a one-armed bandit. <laughs> Stupid. You're nothing but a one-armed bandit. Thank you. Step back, number two. Number three. You are nothing but a one-armed bandit. Aren't I supposed to identify any of the men in jumpsuits? That's none of your concern. Just concentrate. Oh shit, then. Do you recognize Oof. any of them? Yeah, number three's the one. Thank you. Reflecting the aren't I? Am I not supposed to? Okay, lady. Oh. This way. I didn't see it coming. Then. <laughs> then again, I'm not like familiar with like a lot of noir stuff. I, I only know it by a uh, sort of second-hand exposure. I tried to help you, Max, but you didn't listen. Now it's too only late. from derivative works. This is important. It's too late, Payne. I was on your side, Max. Doesn't matter now. You made your choice. You had it your way. I'm busy, Max. Go away. I were you, I'd go to my desk and at least pretend I was doing as I've been told. How do you expect anyone to remember your name? The lineup was done. Mona was back in her cell. The cells were downstairs. Uh, 
Want to get to the lockup? Just press the buzzer by the door. Petersburg will buzz you in. Pain here. I need a statement from one of your customers. Mona Sachs. Max, you've got to get me out of here. You know I can't do that. If I stay here, I'll die. Isn't that a bit melodramatic? Behind bars, I'm a sitting duck. This is as safe as it gets. Come on, Max. Any one of these cops could be on the Inner Circle's payroll. You should know. What's that supposed to mean? You know Alfred Woden. You want answers? Call him. He'll verify everything I've told you. Okay, I'll do that. I didn't want to have anything to do with Woden. I can I use your phone? There's one through the door behind you. You can use that. I need to make a call. You can use this phone. Play some hoops later on? Your funeral. You've reached the voicemail of Senator Alfred Woden. Please leave a message. Woden, Max Payne. We need to have a talk. You ask me, you still owe me. Jesus Christ! A bomb? That was a bomb! Upstairs, now! <coughs> Jesus! Upstairs, now! Something was off. Mona's words on her being a sitting duck kept playing in my head. The bomb had misdirection written all over it. Drop it! Oh! Armed perps in the locker! Officer down! Take him down! Find the bitch! Find her! Kill her! NYPD! Drop your gun! Mona had been right. I had to go after her. I needed a gun to get past the cleaners. would have solved nothing. Mona had vanished into the night. Without her, I had nothing to go on. I knew where to find her. Have no fear. Vlad is here. The world was getting too small for comfort. Too many coincidences. Bang! You're dead, Max Payne. A giant-headed Captain Baseball Bat Boy costume lay in the back seat. Gearing up for Halloween? Max, dearest of all my friends, call it my Trojan horse in the war Vinnie Gogniti started. Speaking of which, any news? Do me a favor. Drop me off at Coney Island. Does the inner circle ring any bells? Nothing mystical about them. Even if they themselves would like to think so. Just one step up the ladder of organized crime. I see where you're going with this. Gogniti has made a deal with them. What about Mona Sachs? I know of her. Her reputation as a hired killer. I hear she is a stone fox. 
I would fuck her. Right then, I hated Vlad. Max, I need to ask your advice as a friend. Ask. Hypothetically, if the only choice you've got is to do the wrong thing, then it's not really the wrong thing. It's more like fate. You have to do what you have to do. It's never that easy. Of course. We agree to disagree. Why was I there again? Wait! Wait just a minute! Talk to me! What are you so afraid of? What do you want from me? The things that I want. My Max Payne. The smoke. A whiskey. For the sun to shine. I want to sleep to forget. To change the past. My wife and baby girl back. Unlimited ammo and a license to kill. <laughs> <laughs> well, we do have unlimited ammo. <laughs> you led them here. Up to my place. We can take them there. This way! The trouble with wanting something is the fear of losing it, or never getting it. The thought makes you weak. I remember this section. That uh, little I thing there. Get her out of my head. Kill them, the cop and the killer bitch. No sidetracking, that's what the boss said. Yeah, yeah, all for it. Can't wait to get out of here. This place gives me the creeps. Fools were a misnomer. They were making a mess of it. Oh, it's there. I'm not going in there. Come on, you baby. This is just like a ghost.
funhouse was Mona's playground. There! She's up there! Look out! She had disappeared back into the shadows. An intervention from above, over too soon. you through. Max, clean it. Sick and tired of the cleaners speeding away in their vans. I had only one chance, no time to stop and think it through. I had no choice. I couldn't have waited for Mona. It was Vlad's excuse. Fate. I didn't trust myself. Max. I'd forgotten about the radio Mona had given me. Max. I'm here to go ride with the cleaners. I'll let you know when we get where we're going. I can't talk now. I couldn't crack her. I had to crack the case. <laughs> There's so many. There's noir overlord bombs in this game. Mona, Castling Insurance Company's construction site. I'm on my way. Take it to the top floor. Yeah, with the rest of the evidence. Hey, careful with those red boxes, you'll blow us all up. I'll get the stuff from the van and meet you there. Hey, what the fuck? I fell out my... of Vlad's Trojan horse. I'd gotten into the cleaner's hideout in the back of their van. They'd give me directions to the evidence on the top floor. internet cropped out. I guess it's okay because I mean they're just recording for YouTube and to get back the six point this would be 6.2 I guess. I think I'll make probably one more part. It'll be a 6.3 as well before part 7. I gotta restart my router. <laughs> 